guys here. We done made it out to her motion. Bike lane A with me. We in the bike lane. You know what I'm Just is what it is. We ride. Let's get it. Alright guys, so we're going on a bike ride today. We're going to see. We're going to probably start at Marina Del Rey. We go all the way to uh, Torrance. Alright? So I'll keep y'all posted. I'll show y'all some of the ride. Alright, peace. Dude ain't going nowhere. Here, but we did have the lights on at one point. So we're going 
about to see. to the beach it's around torrent so people got their weights right there they got a whole gym right there <laughs>
There's a lot going on. We got boats in the ocean. The cops, what they doing? I'm about to say, I'll let you know. Second. Hold up, Eddie. The marina going towards the marina now. Nice boats. This is one of the famous strips in between uh, Playa del Vista and Marina. Yes, 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 you gotta visualize what you want. I see this one in boats. I like the water so much. Ask any medical expert here and he or she is going to tell you that our bodies are an endless source of creation and growth. With no effort at all, our biology creates rhythms that renew us and keep us moving through every stage of life. We fall asleep and wake up. We get hungry, we eat, we digest. We get sick and we heal. We create new life and start the cycle ever anew. From the time we were little babies, it's simply biological law that our bodies grow and evolve. Like every living thing, we humans are hardwired to constantly shift and change. That, my friends, is the energy of creativity, ignited in the most profound and simple way, every moment of every day. Just think about that for a second. That is the energy fueling each of us. How miraculous are we? Welcome to day three, finding the key to your creativity. The force of life itself is within you just waiting to help you move toward where you want to be. So let's connect with that force through today's meditation and let it open us up to all the miracles we can imagine. Deepak is going to guide us there. We're going to take a deep breath and relish in the journey.
these qualities are our greatest allies if you want a fulfilled life. Here we will focus on one quality, creativity. Consciousness is a field of infinite possibilities which each person can access. When you bring hidden potential to life, you're being creative. Creativity is not the possession only of artists and writers. The highest use of creativity is a creative life, which brings freshness and renewal every day. By accessing your creativity, you can always find a way to get unstuck. Every cell in your body knows this already. At this moment, dozens of changing conditions reach your cells. Rising and falling temperature in the outside world. Rising and falling stress. The incursion of a virus or unhealthy food in the diet. Your body has never been in the exact same moment twice in a row. Therefore, it has evolved to create a new response hundreds of times a day. In your own life, you are designed mentally, physically and emotionally to be just as creative because you have free choice to respond to any moment of life exactly as you want to. Stuckness keeps us from accessing our creative potential, which is our birthright. To begin a more creative way of life, some basic points are important. First, stop comparing today to yesterday. Look upon every day as a new world. Because in truth, it is. Only our stuckness makes it old. Second, don't refer to your old self as if it is real. Only today's self is real. You're not the self you were at birth or five years old or last year. Even yesterday's self is an illusion. Third, don't automatically act upon whole thoughts and reactions. If you become aware that the same thought is running through your head, or the same words are coming out of your mouth, pause and say to yourself, I'm not that person anymore. Take a few breaths, center yourself, and when you feel settled, a new response will come to light. You have accomplished something very important when this happens. You are getting unstuck easily, no longer allowing limitations to define who you are. As we prepare to meditate together, let's take a moment to consider our centering thought. I always have access to my inner creativity. I always have access to my inner creativity. Now, let's prepare for our meditation. Make yourself comfortable and close your eyes. Begin to be aware of your breath and just breathe slowly and deeply. With each breath, allow yourself to become more deeply relaxed. Now, gently introduce the mantra, Ananta Swa Bhava. Ananta Swa Bhava. This mantra reveals that your essential self is pure creativity an infinite source of all possibilities. Repeat it silently to yourself. Ananta Swa Bhava. Ananta Swa Bhava. Ananta Swa Bhava. With each repetition, feel your body, mind and spirit open and receive just a little more. Whenever you find yourself distracted by thoughts, noises, or physical sensations, simply return your attention to a 
silently repeating the mantra. Ananta Swa Bhava. Ananta Swa Bhava. Ananta Swa Bhava. Please continue with your meditation. I'll mind the time. When it's time to end, you will hear me ring a soft bell. Ananta Swa Bhava.
it's time to release the mantra. Continue to sit restfully, inhaling and exhaling slowly. When you feel ready, you can open your eyes. Finding the key to your creativity. I always have access to my inner creativity. My true self has no limits or boundaries. We'll go to the message of the day. The message of the day. Day three, finding the key to your creativity. Creativity occurs in the moment. In the moment, we are timeless. Julia Cameron. Creativity is a natural quality of life itself. It is not limited to artistic expression. Living from your creative core means you respond to every moment from a place of possibility and openness. This is how every cell of your body knows to respond to every change of circumstance with adaptability and creativity to maintain its healthy balance. In today's meditation, we learn that our awareness is designed to meet each moment is for the day guys appreciate you joining thanks for joining i'm gonna show you the water now and uh I'll show you a little bit of the sunset and we out day four coming up tomorrow all right peace guys of course we're coming to see the water as usual after meditation for the day. It's a beautiful day out. Keep your creativity. It's today's meditation. If you're trying to be creative. Show your inner light. Show what you're made of. Don't hold back. Always let your light shine, right? And that's it. It's a beautiful sunset today. Till the next time. Peace. We out. All right? Have a lovely day. I just wanted to say one more thing. Don't let nobody kill your creativity. You know? Whatever works for you, whatever makes you feel good and feel blessed, that's what you keep doing. No matter how many people watching, no matter how many people comment, no matter how many people like you, live your life for you. All right? That was another message of the day. Because I almost quit doing this meditation. But it's working for me, so I'm going to keep doing it. Thank you. I'm just going to keep on talking. I don't talk much, but... <laughs> you know, a lot of people not wasn't liking my meditations or maybe not watching them. And... Uh, you can't take it personal. Because it's not about them. It's about you. What makes you tick. What makes you feel good. And it's working for me. I can tell by the way people responding to me energy is so much lighter, you 
you know? And I'm back to myself as just being a giver. So, there's no uh, take food for so long if you're a giver. This is just about giving back. And everything comes to fruition and God just keeps blessing you. And the more good energy you put out there, good vibes. y'all enjoy the last of the sunset it's definitely a beautiful sunset and today again things happen at the perfect timing so i'm learning to let go and not try to control time and just let the universe control me and it always puts me in the right spot of where i'm supposed to be at certain times and the last couple times it's been really nice i've been catching the sunset right without even trying <laughs> i mean definitely trying but it don't matter anymore if it's sunset or regular time i'm meditating all right we out peace